It appears like Haley Bieber has moved on from the well-known Baldwin family a little. The 27-year-old supermodel revealed that, as she prepares to have her first child with husband Justin Bieber, she is not as close to her birth family as she once was. The actress Stephen Baldwin and designer Kenya Deodato Baldwin's daughter is the cover girl. Additionally, she is the niece of actor Alec Baldwin, who co-stars with his wife Ilaria in a brand new reality TV series. Ireland Baldwin, a guest model whose mother is film icon Kim Basinger, is her cousin. In her cover interview, Kendall Jenner's friend mentioned that she doesn't really see her famous family very often these days. I feel like I'm pretty independent, therefore right now in my life, I'm not really connected to my family. She remarked of her marriage to pop superstar Justin, I've built my own family and I'm my own individual now. The blonde clarified, though, that she had fond recollections of her youth. I had a fairly normal childhood, she remarked. I mean, that's my family, obviously, and I've always known that was something distinct. But I have incredibly happy, lovely recollections of my early years and how I was raised. Towards the end of her adolescent years, the road founder began to establish her profession on the catwalk. She noted that at that time, she had to learn how to stand on her own two feet while all of her friends were leaving for college. I started traveling the world and making my own money, she remarked. I had to learn how to live alone and pay my bills after moving into my own apartment. It forced me to transition into adulthood quite rapidly, as the majority of my friends were just heading off to college. Haley disclosed that she and Peach's hitmaker Justin, 30, are merely attempting to savor their remaining time together prior to the arrival of their child. It was really emotional for me at the beginning, of the pregnancy, she stated. Like, I can't stop loving this human. How am I going to involve anyone else in this? I am attempting to savor these moments spent with Justin by myself. Additionally, Haley stated that trolls refuse to acknowledge how happy she and Justin are. The celebrity claimed, since day one, people have made me feel so bad about my relationship. Oh, they're breaking down. They despise one another. They are divorcing each other. People seem unwilling to accept that we are content, she remarked. In 2018, the couple wed in a New York City courtroom ceremony. And a year later, in a more official ceremony attended by friends and family, they went down the aisle once more. The 30-year-old singer Yummy and his intermittent partner Selena Gomez got married around six months later, with Gomez's admirers accusing Road Skin founder and actress of snatching him away from Gomez. Rumors have dogged the couple ever since. Bieber disclosed that she has learned to compartmentalize, and has resorted to counseling in order to cope with the torrent of hurtful remarks she has been subjected to over the years. She remarked, I used to try to act like it hurts less and less. I've made an effort to believe that after a while you grow accustomed to it and that this is how people will speak and behave. About the suffering brought on by the attention from the public, she remarked, but I realize that it doesn't actually ever hurt any less. Her critics continue to spew cruel remarks as her due date draws near. How come Justin picked you out of so many girls to choose from? On the Runway Veteran's most recent Instagram post, someone commented, LOL. Another person added, you should go and love yourself because Justin really doesn't love you or want you and he made a song about you. Another commenter said, Selena would have been better, despite the fact that Gomez, 32, has called her lover Benny Blanco the love of my life. It's crazy to bully a pregnant woman, one of her supporters wrote. Haley, you are shining, happiness looks so wonderful on you, don't let the negativity in. Red Heart, another fan urged, you all need to take the hate out of your hearts and let Jesus in.